Hi, I'm Dana Kennedy, the Product Manager for Accents at CAS Data Loggers. Today we're going to talk about how to download and archive your data from the Accents remote server. We recommend that this be done periodically for reporting and record keeping purposes. Even though the Accents servers are redundantly backed up, it's always a good practice to have a copy of your data stored locally in a safe place. The data you download will be in the form of a CSV file. CSV stands for Comma Separated Values. This file can be opened in Excel or in any text editor. And from there, you can make printed copies to be signed and stored as working documentation of your temperature monitoring and logging practices. The procedure is fairly simple, and we're going to run through it right now. To begin, you simply go to the Accents website, click on the customer login, and log in using your login name and password and the Gateway Mac for your Accents installation. When you log in, you'll see your current alarms displayed at the top of the page. From here, you can scroll down to the latest measurements section, and there is where you'll see all your named monitoring points. Simply select the point you wish to download, and then mouse over to the chart icon and double click. If you've never downloaded any of the data for this point, the easiest thing to do is to simply select the icon that says Download All Data. When you do this, it will download from the server all the data that has been stored for that monitoring point. All you need to do at that point is double click on Download All Data, and you're on your way. If you have a lot of data to download, it may take a few seconds before you see the File Save dialog box, but when it does pop up, you'll see that the name that you have given to the monitoring point is the name of the file. Then all you have to do is simply click the Save button, and the file will be saved to your local computer. Once you have saved your file, you can close the Sensor Chart window and go back to the list of monitoring points to select the next one to be downloaded. Now we'll look at another option, downloading data from a specified time period. We'll begin by selecting a new data point and clicking on the chart icon. Scroll to the bottom of the graph and click on the small arrow as shown. Here you can enter a custom date range for display or download. Here you can click repetitively to move back through the available years of data. Next, use the up and down arrow keys to select the month. Then click on the date, then select the hour, and finally the minute. Repeat this procedure for the ending date entries and then click the reload button. If you've selected a lot of data, it may take a while to load. When your file name is displayed, simply click the save button. And that's all there is to it. If you need further assistance, call 1-800-956-4437 and ask for tech support. Thank you for your time. And please think of Accents for all your remote monitoring and alarming needs.